Hello guys, welcome to Unity 3D Teacher Tutorial. In this video, we are going to see how to make a circular progress bar. So you can use while loading or progressions, whatever. So it's your choice. So like this, you you can able to make a progress bar at the end of the video. So if you see, you can have different progression color like this. So let's see how to do that. Let's go on to the video. So let's create a image. So make middle center. Okay. And then let's have a folder called sprites. So we need a sprite to make a progression. So we have a circular image here. I have dragged and dropped over there. So re let's we rename to circular loading bar. Okay. Then drag and drop the image. Okay. Make it set not set as native and preset of your aspect. After that, I have just duplicated the image. One was BG base and another one is going to be a progression okay okay so let's make a child of the base so in the child we are going to change to tile and then change the color okay so once you change the color you are going to reduce the field to top then reduce the fill amount which you like to have okay so and then try to change the color which you like to have okay and then the base color you can change the base color any color you want to have so I am picking some color okay this is perfect okay I am going with this maybe little bit change Okay, let's create a folder I'm sorry let's create a script so we our plan is to make a progression to be rotated at a runtime so I created a script in order to control the progression open the script and we are going to have a namespace called unity engine dot ui okay and then we are going to call a rect transform in order to make a rotation of a progress bar so equal to get component of right transform by this way you can be able to get the right transform and then we are going to apply in a rotation right transform dot rotate x y is going to zero is that I am going to rotate so we need a speed so I am going to act assign some speed float speed Let's make as public so that we can tweak at a runtime and then drag and drop this I mean copy and paste the script speed with the time dot delta time multiply by time dot delta time with negative on the Z okay now it's fine 
let's try to increase the speed I'm just giving 140 let's see how it work so let's try to increase a little bit more okay I believe this is fine okay let me change the colors and 400 maximize it and let's see how it work this is fine i think so that's it you can able to see that we did a progressive bar or loading bar whatever you like to have or wherever you like to use even you can change the fill amount increase or decrease it's depending upon your requirement so that's it so if you think this video is very helpful for you please subscribe to our channel and hit Bell like.